Hello, Jonathan Landeros with Kativ Technologies, and this is the enclosure, an iLogic exercise. Our challenge, create a warning showing that an enclosure is rated for indoor use only. To get things started, I'm going to show the completed functionality so we can see the goal that we have in mind. I have an assembly, and I'm going to place this enclosure, which I've downloaded off the Hoffman website, into my assembly. And here we can see it gives me a warning stating that this box is rated only for indoor use. If I want an outdoor rated unit, there's a different Hoffman part number I should be using. Now, if this was an indoor application, I could carry on without any problems, but if not, I need to make some changes before I go any further. So how did I do that? Here's the same box downloaded off the Hoffman website, and we're going to add an iLogic rule to it. So on the Manage ribbon, I click Add Rule, and I'm going to call this rule Advisory Label. When I click OK, the editor opens up, and now I can just add a message box. So in the message box section, I choose show, and now I just need to change the messaging. So under message, I'm going to place in the warning text that I have, and then I'm going to give the dialog box a title. I'm going to do a couple more things to this dialog box. At the end of that string of text, before the parenthesis, I'm going to add an OK button as well as an exclamation icon just to give a little more emphasis to this dialog box. And that's it. My dialog box is done. So now I hit OK and already the warning fires. But we want to do one more thing to make sure this fires when we want it to. Under event triggers I'm going to right click and I'm going to add this rule and make it fire when the document opens. So now I can save this document and close it and because of that event trigger when I place this into an assembly that's opening the document and the rule fires giving me that warning. So now I have that check just right there really quickly to make sure the box I've selected is indeed the one I want. So if I make a mistake I can remedy it right away and not get it too far down the design. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching, everybody.